Hello, everyone, and welcome to our final presentation. Our project title is Corporate Investments in Diverse-Led Funds. Our project lead is Dr. Otis Jennings. Our project manager is Aditya John. And our team members are Piper Fitzgerald, Ding Kan Yang, and Kathleen Zhang. Historically, venture capital firms have had a tendency to support predominantly white companies, and minorities have had difficulty getting funding. This is problematic in many ways, but mainly because entrepreneurship provides opportunities for financial growth and success. Our project aims to explore the status quo and assess the true level of support and funding provided by venture capital firms to diverse startups compared to their statements on their websites. Gathering data has been a challenge because most of it can only be accessed through databases that cost tens of thousands of dollars. We began using sources such as Crunch, Crunchbase and Prequin. However, we found that it would only be possible to gather data through manual collection, which was bound to take years for a small team of three, given the sheer amount of available data. After this, we thought it would be best to reach out to the experts and see if they could provide insights. After speaking with Professor David Robinson at Fuqua and Professor Emmanuel Yamfor at Columbia University Business School, we are hoping to foster a collaboration in order to see our data collection process through. We analyzed diverse investment for top 100 venture capital firms based on the data we manually collected from Crunchbase. The bar chart on the left shows how many diversity investment that VC firm has in red versus total investment in blue. As we can see from the box plot on the right, the median percentage is 12.75% and the mean is 12%, yet there are still firms with no diverse investment. We have also built our own metric scale of 1 to 5 to analyze DEI statements of each VC firm has put on its website. It turns out more than half of them mention nothing about diversity. We recognize that our matrix is still um, subjective and we plan to develop the matrix based on more dimensions in the future. We would like to compare this to the actual engagement of uh, each VC firm, for example, the investment status they have uh, when we actually get the merged data. We also explored visualizations that narrow down on one venture capital firm. A limitation we faced is that it took a few weeks to receive a Crunchbase license to access the diversity statistics of startups, so we plan on using the code we made for one firm, Base Ventures, as a template for further analysis. After scraping the data and converting it into a CSV file, I was able to clean the data on R by removing unnecessary labels for the funding round and diversity type and conver converting the money value into a numerical value. After this, I was able to plot the amount of money raised by each diversity type and even see the type of funding round. We plan on continuing this research project through the academic year and expanding our research into different areas. Throughout the year, we will pr assist Professor Yimfor on his goal of categorizing a large data set of entrepreneurs by race to gain access to more data. With this, we want to expand our visualizations to be more accurate and have details about location and type of startup. We are also looking into potential collaboration with DUMAC, Duke's Endowment Fund, and studying their portfolio on a more personal perspective of diversity. Finally, our end goal is to create a research paper or interactive website to display our findings. Thank you.